Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum dear students. I am your maths teacher and this is your maths book of class 5. Now open your books. Exercise 1.4 page number 23. Okay now this is your exercise 1.4 page number 23. Before I start this exercise I can explain to you that what is D mass. Here we have D mass. In D mass D means division. M means multiplication a means addition and s mean subtraction when we have in a question divide multiply addition and subtraction all of we can solve first division second multiplication third addition and the last one subtraction as in the question solve the following 12 multiply 6 divided by 3 how this question is solved? Let's see. Here you have question 12 multiply 6 divided by 3. First we write solution. After solution we have to repeat our question. Okay now. We divide first this 6 divided by 3. 3 into 2 we get 6. Now here the answer is 2. So we write 2 over here, multiply 12 as same. Now in question we have only multiply. So we multiply 12 with 2. 12 multiply with 2 we get 24. And this is your answer. Let's suppose we have another question 14 plus 21 divided by 3. We repeat our question 14 plus 21 divided by 3. Again 21 divided by 3 we get 7 plus 14. 14 plus 7 we get 21 and this is your answer. Now we have another question 128 divided by 4 plus 12 multiply 5. First we repeat our question 128 divided by 4 plus 12 multiply 5. Now here we divide 128 divided by 4 first do the rough work 128 divided by 4 now 4 3 is a 12 4 into 3 we get 12 write 8 over here 4 multiply 2 we get 8 now the answer is 32 we write 32 over here plus 12 multiply 5 now we multiply 12 with 5, 12 multiply with 5, we get 60, 5 into 2, 10, and 60, 60 over here plus 12, 32 plus 60, we get 92, and this is your answer. Okay, now we have another question, 25 divided by 5 plus 4 multiply 3, we divide at first 25 divided by 5 we get 5 plus 4 multiply 3 as according to Dimas. First we divide the term numbers. Secondly we multiply. So over here we have two signs plus and multiply. First we do multiply. 4 multiply 3 we get 12 as remaining same question. Now 5 plus 12 we get 17 and this is your answer. Now the same exercise, exercise 1.4, page number 23. The second question of this exercise is solve the following. Now we have 3 plus 7 bracket multiply 12. Now first I start this question. I can explain to you that what is board mass. Here you have board mass. In board mass, board mass B means bracket, O means order, D means division. M means multiplication, A means addition, S means subtraction. When we have a question like this, for example, 3 plus 7 multiply 12. First, we can solve the bracket. In bracket, we have 3 plus 7. Now, first, we repeat our question 3 plus 7 bracket multiply 12. Okay, now 3 plus 7, we have 10 multiply 12 12 multiply 10 we get 
120 and this is your answer another example we have 6 multiply 9 plus 3 minus 18 first we repeat our question minus 18 now first we solve the bracket in bracket we have two signs multiply or plus as according to Dimas first we solve the multiplication 6 multiply 9 we get 54 plus 3 to bracket minus 18 54 plus 3 we get 57 minus 18 now bracket is over because bracket is solved 57 minus 18 we get 39 and this is your answer again we have a question 6 multiply 18 divided by 9 we repeat our question 18 divided by 9 18 divided by 9 we get 2 multiply 6 6 multiply 2 we have 12 and this is your answer now the third question of this exercise is verify the distributive law now what is distributive law in distributive law we have two sides whether one is left hand side another is right hand side in left hand side we have three numbers or in right hand side we have four numbers in this law answer of the both sides must be equal now we can solve it one by one first we can solve left hand side and then right hand side now you have a question 5 plus 3 multiply 7 equals to 5 multiply 7 plus 3 multiply 7. First we write solution after solution we write left hand side equal to right hand side. Now first you take left hand side which is equals to 5 plus 3 multiply 7. Now 5 plus 3 we get 8 multiply 7. 8 multiply 7 we have 50. 6. Now this is the answer of left hand side. Now we take right hand side. Taking right hand side which is equals to 5 multiply 7 plus 3 multiply 7. 5 multiply 7 we get 35 plus 3 multiply 7 we get 21. 35 plus 21 we get 56. As you know when we have bracket involved in a question first we solve the bracket. So right over here we solve first bracket then plus then second bracket 35 plus 21 we have 56 both the sides are equal so left hand side equal right hand side now we have another question 5 multiply 6 plus 7 equal to 5 multiply 6 plus 5 multiply 7 now again solution after solution left hand side equal to right hand side taking left hand side 5 multiply 6 plus 7 5 multiply 6 plus 7 equals to 13 and 5 multiply 13 which is equals to 65 okay now this is the answer of left hand side now we have right hand side which is equals to 5 multiply 6 plus 5 multiply 7 5 multiply 6 we have 30 first we solve bracket plus then 5 multiply 7 we have 35 30 plus 35 we get 65 both the sides are equal so left hand side equal to right hand side okay now we have another question 6 multiply 13 plus 8 equals to 6 multiply 13 plus 6 multiply 8 now 6 we uh, write the left hand side equal right hand side taking left hand side and left hand side is 6 multiply 13 plus 8. 13 plus 8 we get 21 multiply 6. 6 multiply 12, 21 we get 126. This is the answer of left hand side. Now we have uh, right hand side which is 6 multiply 13 plus 6 multiply 8. First we solve 6 multiply 13 which is equals to 78. Plus 6 multiply 8 we have 48 78 plus 48 we have 126 this is the answer of right hand side so left hand side equal to right hand side thank you students